guys, welcome to a new vlog. I am in Berlin and I'm cat setting Toulouse. I will show you. He's meowing right now. He's a super expressive and loud cat. He is the cutest cat ever and the most beautiful cat ever and the loudest cat ever. Right, Lola? I'm cat sitting him right now for a week and Malik is joining me tomorrow. I have a lot of stuff I have to shoot whilst I'm here, a collaboration, and I'm trying to figure that out because none of the stuff I need to shoot arrived yet and I need to hand in the content in two days and it's very complicated to find people who are available to help me shoot the pictures. So let's see how that will go. I am seeing a postman coming right my way right now. This would actually be... No, he's walking the other way now. I'm meeting my friend Samira now. You already know her um, from previous vlogs. She lives in Berlin. She originally wanted to help me with the content, but now I think we are going to visit Prague Agency. It's an agency I work with very closely in Berlin. And I'm going to visit their showroom and taking Samira with me, meeting all of the girls from the showroom. And then the weather is super nice. It's very spring kind of vibes already and then we will just go get a coffee or something catch up because we haven't seen each other in a while actually she visited me when i had my wisdom teeth removed she was there for me but yeah <laughs> the postman is coming again i really 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 hope this is my package this would be perfect because then i could just take all of the stuff with me now a lot of my friends moved to berlin and i'm going to meet a bunch of girls tonight for dinner and have a girls night. I'm going to take you along. Come on, soft, turn the key and cool her off. This a pause for I have like one hour to change and then I'm meeting my girlfriends for dinner and I got some fun stuff from Arkit and Gunny. I can't wait to show you. I will see the whole through today. I've got better things to do. much at dinner because I didn't see my friends for a long time and I just wasn't in the mood to film but after dinner we went to a organic supermarket and all of us got this banana bread with chocolate chocolate chunks I feel like every time I start talking Tulu starts meowing and then I thought about toasting it and then putting some coconut yogurt with vanilla flavor on top and also some more bananas. Smells amazing and it looks delicious as well. To cut a big slice, honestly two big slices, like this, maybe three. Should we do three? I feel like this is my breakfast, so, and I'm very hungry. Okay, I'm going to, we're just going to put some butter in a pan because my friend tried to toast it in a to normal toaster and it fell apart. So I think maybe if we fry it with a lot of butter, it will get nice and moist and crispy at the same time. I've never cooked here on this stove, so. I haven't received my parcel yet and I really need to start shooting today like, otherwise I will be stressed I think so I hope 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 that it arrives soon it's around 10 now and I'm meeting my friend Samira again she wanted to help me shoot which is very nice but yeah I really don't know if this stuff will arrive on time and I think this is too much butter to take a little bit out. 
Okay, and I need a plate. Now we wait until it's crispy. Peeled the banana halfway and I'm just going to cut it in the peel so I don't waste a plate for it. Now we plate. It's super toasty. Oh my god. Delicious. I'm just going to place all of my... Oh my god, it's kind of burned. Oh no! It's kind of burned. Shit. I didn't re... That's the thing. With new st okay, it's kind it's still okay, but it smells kind of burnt, and that's the thing with stoves. I think every stove is so specific. Oh my god, it smells so burnt. Let's see if it still tastes good. Let's see. I'm using this Harvest Moon coconut vanilla yogurt. I feel like we need a quite generous amount of coconut yogurt on top of this. It would be amazing with peanut butter as well, but we don't have any nut butters here right now. I'm just going to put it on top. That's a super easy and delicious breakfast. I hope it's good. I hope it's not too burnt. We are going to try it in a second. First, I'm going to take these supplements for gut health. My pharmacy prescribed and to me to lose is just tearing apart the chair. Let's dig into this. Probably would have been good as well without toasting it. I have a big bite with coconut yogurt, toasted banana bread and banana. It's honestly so good. I feel like it's such a fancy breakfast and it's so low maintenance. You can do it in three minutes. Probably also not the healthiest breakfast, wow. but wow. it's very delicious. We arrived in Berlin. We're about to get some dinner. I'm so hungry. Let's go. We're going to a place called, what's the name? Who knows? Who knows? To be the cat in the sun. Someday, I will see the world. We're having chicken. One thing about us, we always need a fun drink. And we found this ice cream. It's sold out everywhere in Germany. We wanted to have the Franz Brötchen ice cream, which is basically a mixture between cinnamon bun and croissant. But we just found the pistachio white chocolate one and now I really want to have kombucha as my fun drink but we can't find it and it's the biggest supermarket and we still can't find it. So what do you suggest me suggest for me to drink tonight? I take a mountain. But I don't want something no, a, with like a cherry tea. Caffeine. I want something without Räubersch tea with passion fruit. I think I might take this one. What about you? just got some matcha at Daluma. This is the best matcha. You have to order it with coconut rice milk, iced. It's so good. And we're going on a walk now and then get some work done. And then we are going to Rounded Edgy, which is a cookie place. I am so excited for that. I wanted to try them for the longest time. We went by a side food port and got a White chocolate raspberry cinnamon bun. I just picked up my Cezanne parcel. We didn't end up going to Prenzlauer Berg because we had so much to do, but now I'm going to prepare everything. Friends of mine are coming over. We're going to order dinner and I'm going to do an unpacking of this package. Should I do this tomorrow? I don't want to wait until tomorrow. We are going to try this with my flashlight. I actually have a 
proper light, but I don't have any battery on that one. So, okay, let's unbox. The package is quite big. tote bag. Sometimes you get something for free if you order there. And I got this tote bag. I'm going to give this to my mom. I'm just going to leave it here in Berlin. To lose one straight floor. Of course he does. So this bag. This is so interesting for you, Lule, right? And it's just this big leather bag and I think it's so chic and beautiful. And I also have a big leather bag, but I've worn it for the past three years. So I thought it was time for a new one that isn't as, because the other one is very worn in. <laughs> Toulouse is so cute, wait. What is it with, with cats and boxes? Huh? Shoes. Okay, you might say, how many pairs of black ballet flats does a person need? But these come with a heel and I don't have ones with a heel and I think they're super cute for spring and summertime. I really hope they fit because I'm between 38 and 39 in shoes and they said that I should take size down if you are like in between two sizes, so these ones. And I think they would look super chic in combination with this one was sold out on the website for the longest time and it's this beautiful black trench coat I think it's so nice and I can't wait I'm going to style all of this together actually I think it will look very nice and yeah it's a nice jacket I feel like these are the kinds of jackets you can only wear for like two weeks in the entire year when it's not too cold and not too hot and I think this time is right now so Yes, and also my other package arrived for my collaboration and I will be shooting it tomorrow and hopefully, I think, at least I think so, Greta and her boyfriend will help me. Her boyfriend is a photographer, so that would be nice. I want to elevate my collaborations a little more. Oh my god, the shoes! And they fit perfectly. How cute, I love them. Why does he need to squeeze into this tiny box. He's going crazy. You have to be the cat in the sun. Someday I will see the whole deal through today. I've got better things. Okay, hello. I just shot for the Levi's campaign. I met with Greta and Leo and they helped me with one of the videos but I have to do like a lot of different things. So Malik and I are going to be driving to another spot I want to take my pictures at but the thing is that it's raining non-stop and very grey. I really hope they will turn out kind of okay. We already did one outfit. Malik and I already shot another outfit so Yes, and then we finally will go to Round and Edgy and try these cookies I've been telling you about. I can't get them out of my head. And also, I want to show Malik this very good Mexican place. It's called um, Maria Bonita. It's in Prenzlauer Berg, so pretty close where we are going to the cafe now. And then I'm wearing my new trench coat and Malik loves it. He says I look very Parisian and chic. And I love this little thing that you can just put it like that and see this pattern. <laughs> and I'm wearing this sweater every single day. You have been seeing it on every vlog. I love it so much. It's so cozy and warm and it's been way colder than I thought it would be. So I wear this sweater all the time. It's from a brand called The Room, I think. But I can put it on the screen. Hi.
We finally tried the cookies and they were so incredible. We wanted to wait, oh, no, but we couldn't. Amazing. And it was so good, especially the dark chocolate, no, ch dark chocolate sea salt cookie. It was so... Not dark though. Oh, milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, it was so good. And now we're going to the next spot, to Maria Bonita. back from our food tour it was so good everything we had today was 10 out of 10 really right so first we went to round and edgy to get the cookies we still have two of the three of them like two and a half and we tried two already and they're so good especially if you come there you need to try the dark chocolate sea oh, salt one then we went to the place we had the burritos and the tacos and they were also so delicious and then afterwards we went to material which is a wine bar mm -hmm. but we had something without alcohol and it was so nice it was lemonade with it was lemonade with <laughs> it was <laughs> lemonade with sea salt water and everything i think is from spain and the owners were also from spain and they were super nice and then we went to ruyam and we shared a dinner at actually didn't want any more anything else because I was super full. It was so good that I that I ate like half of Malik's döner. So if you come to Berlin I think it's one of it's a very popular döner place but I also think it's actually one of the best. Right? It was so good. And now we're just driving home and going to watch a movie and chill and see Toulouse. luggage Malika so has to carry it back for me bye Berlin it was nice 